Hi everyone, it is Yen here from Yen C Art. Welcome back to my channel. Thank you for joining me. I am doing a mixed media piece today. At the moment you can see that I'm putting down some tape. Uh, it is supposed to resemble a mountain range, which I'm gonna add to the piece with crumbled up tissue paper, making a 3D effect. It's gonna look really cool. I, I really love the outcome. Um, this all came about because Kathleen Osmore uh, challenged her Patreon group to do a mixed media uh, piece and uh, this is my entry to the challenge. Uh, right now I'm doing the dirty cup as you can see and I'm gonna flip that on the top part. In the description you'll see a list of the paints that I used and how I mixed them and um, I will not be talking much more uh, while I'm doing this. I will be playing some music and I may come back every now and again um, and just uh, comment on what I'm doing. But right now I'm may, I'm doing the, the flip cup um, and um, yeah, I'll come back to you. I'll just be playing some music. Please don't hesitate to ask me questions if you have any questions about what I did um, and uh, I'll answer them as good as I can. So enjoy the music and um, I'll be back every now and again. Oh, by the way, I did want to add that um, at the end of the video, I will link to a video where I'm showing you how I prepared the tissue paper, the moon, the stencil, uh, the crackle paste uh, on this uh, painting or for this painting. So if you are interested in that, there will be a video posted uh, with, um, with those um, preparations. So do stick around and uh, check out the, the link at, at the end of the video. And now I will mm, keep my mouth shut <laughs> and uh, play some music and I might come back. back again right here I just want to comment on the effects that the tape actually cost this is really cool this is exactly what I wanted but I didn't actually know that it was gonna work as you can see there are actually some peaks um, here and there where the tape was whether I had made the peaks um, with the tape so that is really cool how it, it actually worked out um, I'm really happy with it and right now I'm just peeling off the tape uh, under the uh, paint under the paint where the moon is um, this is where I intended for it to look as if the um, moon was partially covered by the clouds so um, but I'll uh, let you enjoy the music and uh, I'll, as I said I might come back again
last two. A little drunk, but I'm alright. Cause I've been hanging with you, and it feels like love. Tell me if I'm wrong. Cause it feels like love. Yeah, it feels like love. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Uh. I want you here with me. Am I out of my mind? Or is this how it should be? You made me sing about love. So just tell me if I'm wrong. But it feels like love. Yeah, it feels like love. Yeah. And here I decided that I wanted to uh, make the moon stand out a little more than it did. It was a little too muted, so I added some uh, golden fluids, iridescent pearl, um, and filled out the parts that had not been covered with the dirty cup that I poured. When I look at it now, it might actually look as if the parts of the moon, the white, white parts, are actually clouds and uh, that the darker parts are, parts are the moon but it that doesn't really matter to me it looks like a moon just as I wanted it to so I'm happy with it I will uh, later you will see that I also create like a halo around the moon just to, to make it stand out even more I will be back a little crazy for you now baby I And I decided that the crackle part was a little too harsh. The line between the pour and the crackle part was too harsh. So in order to soften that up, I um, added some some of the darker tissue paper that I had made. Not 3D. Uh, this is one or two layers. Uh, it still looks a little crumpled, but but not the way that the other mountain range looks like. And um, and uh, yeah, I, I think that that really softened up the border between the, the crackle part and then the poured part so I really I'm really happy with with the outcome now I think that I'll um, shut up for now and I will show you and narrate um, the final part that will come up in a few seconds but um, apart from that I just want to thank you for being here and uh, 
do stick around for, and check out the video that tell, shows you how I did the tissue paper and everything. Thank you for being here and have a great day. Bye. And here is the final result. Not varnished yet, but I'll give it a satin varnish. So I added an extra <clears throat> row of mountains here. It's all the tissue paper. Darker colors and not 3D. This is the 3D, as you can see. Looks really cool. And I actually also love, love the way that these mountains were created automatically when I did the dirty flip cup. You can see that in the video how that happened. It was because of the tape that I put on and removed. There was a natural, some natural peaks. So that worked really well. Here's the moon. I put a halo around it. Yep, so that's it. Tell me what you think. Thank you.